Hi, I'm Katrina De Monteverdi with ID8 TV, and I am here with the talented Dot Marie Jones. How are you today? You're so sweet. I'm good, Annie. How are you? Good. Thank you for asking. Well, I wanted to ask you, how was your time during Glee? Because that was one of the most inspiring, most amazing television series that I've ever, ever watched in my life. And your character especially really, really got to me because I, I love that it's so inspiring. It makes a difference. Um, people can relate to it um, in such a different way, you know, like where yeah. um, it wasn't so, so talked about in the past. Right. Um, where, where now it's just like, it's coming out so it's so much more comfortable um, to to be in you know in in that character or you know the character that you're playing. I wanted to see like just pick your brain on like how did you feel about playing your role? I loved it. My character I feel like went through so many different roller coasters. Like when I first started, the whole being bullied. Here I am, this big giant, and being bullied by everybody, and then the whole domestic violence thing, and then from that, taking a whole 180 to the transitioning. And um, it was all overwhelming, overwhelming. And, and I'm very proud of what I did on there and what they trusted in me. Yes. They interested in me to, to, you know, to bring to life. And it's, I still, to, to still, it's been off the air, what, three years? And, and still getting such a response, it's, I love it. Yes because it means it meant something. Oh, it totally does. And it, it really instills like a lot of a lot of emotion, a lot of um, a lot of lessons and you know how to treat people well yeah. and just like respectfully. So so yes. I, I love the show. I love your character. Um, you. What else are you working on? Um, I just got done um, uh, as far as horror genres. I did my first horror film. I did Rob Zombie's um, the sequel to Devil's Rejects, it's called A Three From Hell. It'll be out after, in 2019. Okay. And then I just did another comedy in Georgia. I was back in Atlanta for a few weeks and did, um, actually Peachtree City, Georgia, and uh, did a, a movie called Greener Grass. Okay. It's hilarious. Okay. And um, I'm going back, hopefully going back to Georgia at the end of, um, the end of November to do another episode of The Resident. I did one last year, and so they're bringing me back. Very nice. So I'm, I'm glad to hear that you're so busy. You're all uh, over the place. <laughs> I was dead for a while. I was worried, and then it's starting to slowly pick up again, which I'm very grateful and thankful for. Yeah, and I feel, I mean, the industry is always like that. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, it's always going to have its up and downs and everything. Yes. But I, I wish you the most success. You're I'm so a huge sweet. fan, so I'm glad that you're here today, and, and thank I you. thank you for doing the interview. Oh, sweetheart, yeah. it's my pleasure. <laughs> Give me some love. Okay.